The Mohammed Nawaz Sharif University of Engineering and Technology, MIN SUET, Moulton successfully conducted the Engineering College's Admission Test, ECAT, today for admissions into its Engineering and Engineering Technology undergraduate programs. A significant number of aspiring students appeared in the test, reflecting the growing interest in the university's academic offerings. The ECAT test was held under strict security protocols and organized in a disciplined and transparent manner, ensuring a smooth and fair testing environment for all candidates. The worthy Vice-Chancellor of MNSET Moulton, Professor Dr. Engineer Tahir Sultan, paid a special visit to the test center to oversee the arrangements and ensure the efficient conduct of the examination. He was accompanied by the registrar, Professor Dr. Usimama, who played a key role in monitoring the administrative aspects of the event. During the visit, the convener of the admission committee, Dr. Mohammed Islam, provided a comprehensive briefing to the vice chancellor regarding the test arrangements, security measures, candidate verification procedures, and the overall execution plan. Dr. Islam appreciated the collective efforts of all faculty and administrative staff in ensuring the successful conduct of the test. Also present at the center were Dr. Zishan Rasul along with other esteemed members of the admission committee, who worked diligently to facilitate a fair and organized testing environment. Their coordination and commitment contributed significantly to the day's success. Speaking on the occasion, Vice Chancellor Professor Dr. Engineer Tahir Sultan expressed satisfaction over the arrangements and lauded the efforts of the university team in conducting the test in a highly professional and transparent manner. He also interacted briefly with candidates and staff, encouraging them to continue striving for academic excellence. MNSET Moulton continues its mission to uphold academic integrity and merit-based admissions in line with the highest standards set by the Higher Education Commission, HEC, and the Pakistan Engineering Council, PEC.